I'm Karen Dutrice. Um, you might remember me as being Jane Banks in Mary Poppins. And I'm happy to be here today talking to my friend from Convention Scene UK. Okay, we're here. We're here in Reading. Uh, we're just staying at the, well, just stayed overnight at the Premier Inn, Reading Central. Amy and Alice are both here. Hi. Say hi, Alice. Alice isn't in the best of moods at the moment because. It could be the midnight bedtime. Yeah, it could be the mid midnight bedtime. <laughs> it's probably uh, <coughs> awful when you stay in the same room. It's really not good. Um, but yeah, it's it's not too bad. But this is what I've got a problem with. This is what I've got a real problem with. You know, sunny, sunny south, is it? What is all that? Uh, yeah, so we're looking forward to today, aren't we? Yeah. yeah? Deaf for dog. Deaf for dog. Alice is learning. <laughs> Alice is learning a phonics. Yeah. Phonics. If you were what that was. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, we better get going. Never yes. Oh. Yeah, we better go before she goes to, on to put uh, just <laughs> right. <laughs> All right. Um, okay, we're gonna head off now. We're gonna check out and just have to nip up Tazda because we are setting back up, uh, setting uh, setting back up north later on today. We're only here for the one night, so four hours down, four hours up. Oh. It's it's not too bad, but we'll uh, better get organised so we can shoot off straight after the con. So, um, so yeah, let's hope. Hopefully, it'll be a really good day. So, wow. I, I, I just said to Amy uh, that she, I said, "Are you going to get in a, a, the oh, video for this?" But she had no idea who this was. So that shows how much younger. Amy is than me. Not much of you. You still should, should, should know who this film. is. I've just never watched it. Johnny Five. Well, you've said that now. There he is. Oh, can he talk? Really cool. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Have you got that? Yeah. Oh. He's very cool. Do these move? On a 30 second loop. Oh, right, okay. These are also um, attending. Uh, for the love of the 80s in ah, Edinburgh as well. But just for the check. Oh, Lovely. you'll be there, won't you? I'm yeah, I'll there. be there. I'll be there. Brilliant. How long did it take you? Yep. Two years. Two years? Two years. Wow. 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 It's still not finished. Really? You need, you need the laser. <laughs> you need to do one time the pump, the pump run. In fact, I'm actually in the works of already started bringing them the head. Oh, really? Because um, I've had a lot of requests for the pump one. Oh, that'd be funny. So if it's a blackout one eye, get the pump thing on, get some chains around him. That'd be hilarious, but... <laughs> That's well cool. I want it. How much is it? How much? I mean, I'd ask you how, uh, how much this is all fashioned to debt. It's, it's in the four-figure region already. Four-figure. Wow. wow. It's worth it, though. Definitely. I'm not going to be able to say this now. <laughs> this is this is so deviant, <laughs> so deviant. <laughs> um, we're just having a nosy now. Um, I think Alice might be. Well, we're having some issues. We're having issues. She's being hard work. Oh, <laughs> oh bless. Are you being a pain in the bum? She's too hot and she's tired. I think we're yeah. we're going to make this uh, decision for her. Right. I, think. I really want. No, look that. at that. Oh my God. But Alice has now said she would like a Batman cushion. <laughs> oh, oh, I don't know which. Oh. Batman cushion or oh, See, no, I'm, I'm or Batgirl. Oh, oh yeah, there's Batgirl there. Look. Oh. He's awake now. He's the awake. The is now awake. He's awake. He's awake. All right, hang on. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow! How good is that? He's chewing it! <laughs> oh, that's good. Do you think he likes the leaf? Yeah. Dinosaur eggs. You can give him a tiny end of the chair. Oh. Nice big one. Oh! 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 Oh!
skate, yeah. <laughs> Not so sure, Alice. Look. Look. Good girl. Oh. Okay, we're at a stall called Baidan. Baidan. And tell me the reason behind that name again. So Baidan is a Scottish name for Gordon, which is my last name. And she so. says she's Scottish. I, I don't I'm know if I English, believe that. English sounding Scot you'll ever meet. Yes. I, I don't know if I, I believe. I look Scottish. I've got the freckles. <laughs> <laughs> so you know, pop it in the comments below we're if, from you don't, if you don't think. About 25 miles north of Aberdeen. That's where we're all from. <laughs> ah, you see now I have no idea where that is. So yeah. she must be. No, from from Aberdeen. What yeah, was the North other place? All yeah. oh, right, okay. Oh, sorry, we'll go and we'll have a nose <laughs> no in this. Look, okay, what have you spotted? Look at these. Now, I, you know, I like my different jewelry. Look at these teapot earrings. Look, they look like they've got. Although they, they are real tea. Really? And it's not just any tea. This is Fortnum and Mason afternoon blend tea. Wow. So if you're ever caught short, it won't make a very big cup of tea, but it makes what? a really good cup of tea. Look. <laughs> But yeah, it's all wow! I've never seen anything like that before. See, now then you'd be stuck. Would you get a teapot and a cup, or two teapots? That's the question. And what are all these? They're so these are goggle inserts. So goggle we mainly insert. do steampunk events. I was about to say they're very steampunkish. They are very steampunk. So they're inserts that go in goggles. But if you don't wear goggles, I can also put badges on the back so you can wear them as a badge as well. That is from Pirates at Caribbean, isn't it? Yep. Yeah, that is very there cool. Is, I mean, piratey theme is quite a big thing sort of within steampunk as well. So lots of people do like piratey. Oh, oh I'm I can't oh, remember I'm my name. Oh, I'm from so, Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's me shamed on my own vlog. That's awful. Oh, <laughs> How long does it take to make a brooch? It varies. Like I mean, the brooch is because it's just a waiting for each level to dry. Um, so you sort of make one level. These make are a insane. Go and do another level. Go the make another cup of tea and <laughs> do another level. Go to the toilet. Oh, look at that pirate <laughs> one. <laughs> Some of them not so long, I mean these don't take so long, but things like these ones, I mean I've done some that are really, like really tall and really sort of three-dimensional and, um, and goggle inserts stuff. for the Lego figures. So some things don't take as long to make, no. but then others sort of balance with each other out. <laughs> yeah, so guys, if you uh, if you are you are interested, yeah, we're going to pop the link in the uh, yeah. details yeah. below. <laughs> Bye, Dan. And I'm sure Amy will be looking to get something from here sh very shortly. <laughs> there we go. Are you happy now? Have you got the stars in the background? Yes. I'll only be happy if you got that in the background. Of course, I've got the stars. And then I do my grumpy. There you go. Yeah. Oh. And she be evil. Look at my <laughs> <laughs> Oh dear me. Oh, yeah. There we go. There we go. There she is. Look at that face. <laughs> what we woke up to. Yeah. That's what happens when she get, doesn't get ice cream. <laughs> okay. Alright, you go there. Put it over your feet. We'll have to insert the picture when we've had it taken. <laughs> so Alice came 
across this stall first, and then obviously the bright colours. These stop touching sweet tarts. So they have so many colours. So what's it called again? This one? Possum. Possum crafts. I knew straight away from when I got told that I would completely forget that. So I mean, look at these tiny doors. I mean, I'm not a a boa man, <laughs> thankfully, but you know. Alice and Amy both seem really interested in these. Please stop touching. So what earrings are you looking at? I really like these. Oh, they're nice. Yeah, I think I'm going to buy them. Yeah. Alice, would you like to wear these rings? Yes, she has enough. So yeah guys, uh, check them out. Uh, Possum Crafts. Uh, we'll see what Amy's going to go and purchase now. Look at that. Yeah, Alice is just getting gearing up to uh, one down here. have a go at Negan. Oh, Trying to encourage violence. You've got to shove your mean face. You've got a mean face. You have to, there. you have to do a mean. <laughs> you, you have to do a. You have to go a, like Hulk. Look at me, look, Alice. Here we go. Come on. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot not buy it. And it's the only one <laughs> yes. at the moment. So the original as well. It's, original. it's an original. <laughs> so we have to get is that. Is it signed? Is it? Have you signed it? Yes. Oh, well, I was going to say oh. you've not. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking of glossing it as well, but there might be still. Yeah, no, no. This stall is Vivina Henry. And these are really good. I mean, look at. Like yeah. I even do um, Inktober, I don't know if you've heard of it. No. It's like a challenge every October, every year, made by this guy called Jake. So this has gone down to my artwork. <laughs> this has gone to your own artwork? Yes. And what's your name, sir? I'm Lauren, but this is a uh, Dark Lauren Art. Dark? Dark Lauren Art. Dark Lauren yeah, Art. Right. right, okay. I'll just zoom in on that so I don't forget. There you go. Let me zoom in. And there we go. There's some amazing pieces here. Um, I can't stop it. I just covered this. I don't know. It's just everywhere. I, I really like that. I don't know who that is. I'll be. I'll admit. That is my own design. That is your own design. Some of these are my own design, like this one here. Obviously you've got Renji, you've got all the characters there. These two are my own design. Um, and obviously these ones here, so most of those are my own design as well. Wow. I do love Mario. Oh, I always love, love Mario. Mario. You've got to love Mario. <laughs> I can never remember that Pokemon. That's Haunter. Haunter, yeah. yeah he's yeah. actually right there. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> okay, so... Another hint and tip for you, which again is something I always forget. As you may have noticed, the hair has gone up. It is so hot in these places. Like, it's ridiculously hot, sweaty, a little bit stinky. Not from me. You're not whispering at the camera again, are you? No. So I just wanted to add another hint and tip to our hint and tip video. Be prepared for the heat. Okay, this is a very special moment for us. Uh, we are with the lovely Karen Detrice, who has agreed to answer a couple of questions for us. Uh, so thank you for being on Conventions in UK. Pleasure. And uh, I'm, we're extremely happy, as you'll uh, probably see in the footage just shortly uh, before this interview. Um, uh, Alice was mesmerised, um, and I'm really, you know, just got perfect memories of that meeting that you're one of the nicest people we've met so thank you for that thank you your family is adorable <laughs> and you. i'm sure your fans are too so come on everybody subscribe let's get more subscribers because i'm going to be watching you too now <laughs> and i'll get other celebrity fans to tune in as well so let's get the numbers up <laughs> um so just I, I know you're about to take stage soon so just a couple of questions if possible my uh, uh, amy was just uh, wondering one thing uh, what is your opinion of them doing a sequel for Mary Poppins yes. and do you think yeah. they chose the right actress? 
I think uh, I, my personal belief about the fact that we now are going to have Mary Poppins returning, literally, that's the title of the movie, Mary Poppins Returns, is there couldn't be a better time. I think the world needs Mary Poppins. I know I need Mary Poppins. Uh, things are a bit sketchy in the world for the minute, and the whole idea that coming up to Christmas, starting in December, we're going to have a fun, fantastical movie uh, bringing Mary Poppins back into the world. I think it's a great idea. I'm all for it. And uh, Emily Blunt, who plays the new Mary, um, she is magical. She's such a great gal. She's really wonderful. And uh, the whole cast is magnificent. You've got Emily Mortimer, Ben Whishaw, uh, Meryl Streep, Colin Firth. Everybody's in it. Do you think that you see very similar some similarities between Emily Blunt and Julie Andrews and with how they portray the character? Or do you think they have their own way of doing things? Um, Emily Blunt's got her own way of approaching it. Um, as she said to me, you know, I can't possibly be Julie Andrews. I'm not going to try. I think she's closer to the book. She's closer to P.L. Travers' version of Mary right. Poppins. Uh, so she's, you know, as was Julie. So I think both of them were just trying to be Mary Poppins from the book. Uh, and then as actresses, their own skills come through that. But they're both practically perfect in every way. <laughs> I like that. I like that. Um, I mean... What what I can't get over is I mean I mean we absolutely love that we've met you today, but at the same fact that you grew up in a world with Walt Disney and we we can't get over that that that's completely boggled our minds. I mean, you referred to him as uh, Uncle Walt, didn't you? Do you yes. still you still do? Uh, I think I've heard in a couple of interviews. And, yes. And how was that? Like, that must have been such a an amazing time yes. growing up. I mean, it was. Um, I mean, what what was your experience uh, working with Walt? Uh, well, Uncle Walt was an amazing man, and I I knew that personally. But actually, a lot of why he was so amazing to me personally made sense when I saw the movie Saving Mr. Banks. Um, I don't know if you've seen it, but when you see that film. You see that uh, he portrayed why P.L. Travers had created Mary Poppins because she'd had a terrible childhood with an alcoholic father and stuff. And Walt Disney had had a terrible childhood with uh, having to work for his parents and selling newspapers in the snow and stuff. And when I went to the premiere of that movie, I, I just started to cry because I thought, that's why Uncle Walt was so nice to me because I was an eight-year-old kid and he wanted to make sure that if any, any child having a youth that it was going to be joyful and magical so he made sure my experience as an actress was joyful and magical we became personal friends and in his diary at the archives at Disney he's it's got entries saying lunch with Karen trees just the two of us uh, and you know we were good mates he uh, I was sick one time and he actually came to my house and, and sat on the bed and read me stories and bought me presents and you know oh, wow. this is Walt Disney which uh, I didn't even twig that at the time because he was just like a big uncle. Um, a super cool guy, but what he wanted for the world was that magic, not just for himself to heal his wounds or to make sure I didn't have any wounds, but for every kid and every adult that's watching now to make sure that we feel that joy that we experience through Disney films, that you'll experience through Mary Poppins Returns, and that we experience with, like your little Alice who was just singing Let's Go Fire Kite. All of those magical things that he gave us um, and Disneyland, Disney World, you know, his legacy goes on. It's one of the few studios that still bears the name of the originator. Yeah. So there isn't another one because there's nobody else like Walt Disney. And it's certainly uh, continuing to be as, as successful. I, I mean, it's growing in success now, the stature of it with all the different purchases of all the different studios. Yeah. I mean, uh, I mean... It's, it's just amazing. I mean, uh, only one last question, if that's possible. Is that okay? Um, who, right, and this might... I, I, I always find it... I feel uncomfortable asking these questions. Go on. Who, do you find, who did you find was a, a real pleasure to work with on, on set? Who really stood out 
uh, is That's a lot easy. of fun. Dick Van Dyke. I mean, Julie stayed in character because you know she wanted we kids to respect her, her on screen. But Dick Van Dyke was just a naughty little boy all the time. <laughs> he was always you know doing pratfalls, falling over himself, being daft and silly, and uh, and super fun. We uh, we just had so many laughs with him, and and he's a good friend today. You know uh, we text each other, email each other, we're on each wow. other's social media. I see him probably about once a month. Oh, uh, wow, that, that much. Richmond, Richard Sherman too from the Sherman yeah, Brothers were really good mates still uh, oh, wow. had dinner with them last week and uh, so you know we're a Disney family oh, yeah, and uh, so the mouse house continues at my house it certainly see, it seems to be the case um, wow I, I'm, I'm speechless uh, even managing to speak <laughs> well, to you yeah, yeah. That's, that's unusual you've done nothing but talk so I'm very impressed uh, we finally made you speechless <laughs> uh, so thank you very much uh, um, for uh, a bit well doing this interview for Convention Scene UK and um, again this is the wonderful uh, Karen Detrice who plays Jane from Mary Poppins. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> you saying bye, Alice? Hey, Alice. You want me not? Good to see you. Thanks for coming. Right. Well, that was certainly a busy day. Yep. <laughs> oh, I mean, and just. <laughs> it was so warm. It was so so warm in there. Yeah. I mean, it was crazy. It was very busy. Very mm, busy. A lot busier than I thought it would mm. be, to be honest. Why? I don't know. I mean. You look at you look. I think what Amy's trying to say is, you, you when you're driving in, the venue doesn't look. Well, it just looks like a small leisure centre. So I mean, I was expecting like one room, uh, you know. But it it was busy. It was busy, wasn't it? Uh, mm -hmm. uh, got another. Got a few bits and bats. Uh, did, did we get a lot? I but, got, I oh yeah, we did. We get a few bits. We won't go into that yet. I got quite a lot. <laughs> did we? It feels like it. I've been my bags were getting heavier and heavier all day. Oh yeah, we did. We have to stop a couple of times, um, yeah, and it and and we. It, this convention really was made for us yeah. when we spoke to Karen Detrice, J, uh, which is uh, Jam. She plays uh, Jam Banks. <laughs> Jam Banks. Yeah, did you say Banks. No, I said Jane Banks because oh. you were coughing. Oh. Jane Banks from Mary Poppins. Honestly, childhood dream came true. She's such, so, so, so friendly. You'll see, for, uh, see from the video anyway. We sang, we sang with her. Yeah, we, we sang with her. <laughs> on, 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 on that note. Um, <laughs> yeah. We have to shoot back up north now. Talking. Long, long drive. <laughs> four hours, I think. Four and a half hours. I hope you, uh, you guys. Uh, Look how sweaty you are. I'm That's so disgusting. so warm in here. Look, yeah. um, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, yes. I feel that we we found you know there's quite a bit, quite a bit more to this convention to film. Mm -hmm. We're gonna get going because we need to drive. Well, I need to drive. So I will see you soon. Well, our next bit you'll see us will be in our hall of the week. Yes, I know you don't like that. Okay, it's the next day. Um, still quite tired yeah. from the journey. Took us probably just over four hours getting there. Mm -hmm. uh, four hours getting back. All in the space of well, twenty-four just, hours. Yeah, t well, just over twenty-four hours it was, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Was it less than that? No, it, was, it doesn't matter. Yeah, no, in the space of twenty-four hours, that's crazy. Yeah. It was fun. It, it was, was fun though. It, it, was, was, it was great fun. fun. It was a lot of fun. Uh, we had a lot of fun at uh, Reading Comic Con. And uh, thanks to Paul for yes, inviting us. You. It was uh, very nice of you. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, we got to meet some, well, you know, obviously because Amy goes on about it all the time, the whole Disney fanatic. Mm -hmm. And, you know, and we do love our Disney. Mm -hmm. um, and even though Ross from Walking Dead cancelled, we were still just as excited, probably even more excited to see uh, Karen Detrice. Mm -hmm. uh, so we're really happy with that. <coughs> Obviously you guys now would have seen that. We yeah. managed to get an oh, interview with her. Oh, it was amazing. Uh, yeah, so. And Alice went really, really shy. Um, like, you know, you would expect. It's new people, she's only four. Um, but Karen 
was singing to her and we all joined in and honestly she was she was really really was... nice how she got her to do it she kind of uh described her, her like you said oh what how would we make a kite and how would we do this i mean like uh, i said uh on a previous video amy's got a let's go fly a kite uh tattoo and but it's mainly from when alice was about just she was younger than two years old she could barely speak but she <laughs> she mimed not mimed she uh kind of sang the she song sang, but it uh, as to how she like could hear it words. broken english in a way yeah um so but, it's always it's always been a really really special film um as has saving mr banks so the whole mary poppins sort of thing thing has always meant a lot to us hasn't it yeah yeah, yeah. um so to be able to meet karen yeah, it's it was almost like a dream come true and for her to spend so much time with us oh yeah yeah she's, um, she's hugging and kissing alice picking her up yeah and just, saying bye to alice commenting to yeah. her whilst she was in, uh, in um, the audience as well so, yeah and you probably caught that in the video well, i don't know it depends Everybody. how we've edited it i don't know maybe maybe not but yeah during the panel she made reference to alice which was lovely um so it was really nice i mean uh guess wise we only met Karen Detrice. Mm -hmm. I actually bu bumped into uh, Hugh, um, what's what's Hugh's surname, plays uh, Colin Creevy in uh, Harry Potter. Uh, I've worked at an event before that he attended, so it was really nice to see Hugh again. Um, and he remembered me. He said he did. I don't know. He he, he seemed to he <laughs> he brought up where we we where we knew each other from. So, so, obviously, so he obviously remembered my face. So yeah, I was happy with yeah. that. Um, so I got well, chatting with him as well. So yeah, it was good. Yeah, it was a good event. Like there was, was a, I was just sorry. I was about to say uh, when we were on the way home last night, we've done like this is our fourth conquest now. Cov Con Chester Preston and Reading. Yes. Yeah. Uh, so. Out of all of the conventions so far, this seemed to have a very, uh, you know, even though the venue wasn't huge, it had quite a, a varied uh, things to look at with regards. Mm, mm -hmm. uh, Johnny Five from Short Circuit, which yeah. I loved. Yeah. Uh, the props are good. Um, the dinosaurs. So although we always try and give you all the positives, and don't take that as in there are a lot of negatives to these events, because there are not. Believe me, are there? They're not. No, I've not really come across um, it. We just, uh, because we go to so many, we kind of feel like, you know, you know, we'd like to, re you know, say like our recommendations. Yeah, more than anything. More than anything. Um, yeah. You go ahead. I was just going to say, um, we noticed that the area for the panels was in the same room as the guests were so people were going and getting their autographs having a chat um and i just found trying to listen to the panel with the girls in the afternoon it i it was struggled difficult. It I, was I, difficult. I think i missed a lot of it because there were people in the back talking quite loud yeah. they weren't whispering they, they weren't whispering they're very loud um i think even if it you know that i think it could have been managed just by saying you know, just having somebody at the back and just watching, just saying, just to keep the noise a bit down a bit. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that, that got quite loud, and I, I felt kind of felt a bit bad on the panel, the yeah. guests at the panel themselves. You could see they... that they kept sort of glancing over. Yeah. As if to say, please be quiet. <laughs> um, but that was the only thing. That's yeah. you know, it's not a big thing. It wouldn't no, have stopped no, me going it again. No, it wouldn't. It's just that, and maybe a, a, just a little thought there. Um, I mean, you know, the, the the event was really busy. Yeah. It was really busy. So, I mean, I can imagine pretty much all the volunteers and anybody involved in the event would have been run off the feet. Yeah. Um, so, I mean, maybe it wasn't possible to do that no, at the time. Which is so, fair. you no, know, I mean, fine. it was just an observation we made. It. We still loved the event. Yeah. And, um, you know, we're glad we made the trip. So, yeah, definitely. Um, so yeah, we only got a few bits and bats. We also mm -hmm. got some of the competition prizes as well. Mm -hmm. uh, we'll start with uh, the haul of the week. Yeah, we're going to say that the hot, the haul, just the haul. That no, just that, the haul. It's like, it's like moist. I don't like. It. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's not get into that. <laughs> right, come on. Okay, um, so first of all, we'll show you our autograph. Ah yes, autograph. <laughs> this has actually been made out to Alice as well uh, from. Karen Detrice. Yeah. Um, Amy was a bit gutted by no, that. No, but you know, you have to do what's best for the children. <laughs> okay. Are you showing it? No? Yes, there you go. Look. 
You see it. How cute. Yeah, so Alice was thrilled to bits. It says, to Alice, great to meet you. Let's go fly a kite together. Love, Karen. Jane Banks. So yeah, she she really, I mean, she, she wouldn't leave the panel until she said bye. I feel like I want to know her more. <laughs> I feel like... I don't know. She could be my she was, she was a very nice person. She She's definitely got a very interesting life. She's like... Oh, uh, yeah. Some of the I stories mean, talking about... One everything. of the Sherman brothers, she has lunch with him all the time. She loves... He's one of his, one of the neighbours. Yeah, the neighbours. Uh, one of the neighbours. Could you imagine? She speaks to Dick Van Dyke at Monthly. least once once a month. Um, I don't know. She text messages, calls, that kind of thing. And just talking about Walt Disney, obviously. Yeah, knowing Walt Disney, that's just insane. That that's, is insane. Yeah. Yeah, um, Uncle Walt. As Uncle she Walt, it. yeah. Mm. So yeah, so thank you. So that was our only autograph we got. Mm -hmm. Um, so what do, what else did we get next? Um, I'll show you. Well, what I was gonna do is these people we didn't necessarily get their details. Um, but I just wanted to comment on the variety of things that Alice found. Oh yeah, she yeah, had no, um, some pocket money. Not this time, like she does every time. Uh, but sometimes we do struggle. Um, for to buy her things or things that she's interested in. Um, so I'll just show you these really quick. It was quite random. <laughs> Very it? random. The life of a four-year-old. Um, little Lego friends bag, a little set. And that was a bargain. That was only a pound. So she was made up with that. Um, oh, I was these. quite happy with these because <laughs> I owned majority of these. We've been playing with these all day, haven't we? Yeah, they're all the old uh, McDonald's. Look at Happy these. Meal Time yeah. from the 80s. Look at them. So, I mean, I remember only at least about Look. four or five of them. Yeah, it says 80s and 90s McDonald's. And we got the a whole bag for a pound. <laughs> so she, and she's and so into a little gadgets and little... Anything, anything that does yeah. We spend yeah. we spend the fortune, you know, spend loads of time trying to find her something that's really cool, really expensive, but she's been playing with ever, ever since she got back. Yes. So, yeah. Um, yeah, and the next thing that Alice bought oh, was yeah, from... This is good. A lovely, lovely company. Um, I'll show you there. So deviant. <laughs> so deviant. <laughs> that sounds. That even that just so sounds like you're from. Deviant. Me. We noticed in Reading that Warren's accent shone, shone, shined through. Shined through. Yeah. Yes. Um, a couple of comments on it. Like anyway, yeah. This was one of them. <laughs> so deviant. There you go. Like. We'll pop the details below. Yeah. Um, they had the most gorgeous skirts for children and adults and I was trying to use my power of persuasion on Alice to buy a handmade skirt that had... There's all the Marvel characters. Yeah. Yeah. So but, like Captain America, Hulk, everybody um, on it. But she went having any... I was like, you can wear it for your birthday party. She's like, nope. She nope. wanted the pillow. She wanted the pillow. And... She and picked. I don't blame her. Mm -mm. Bat it's girl. pretty cool, wouldn't it? She's not gone to sleep yet because she's uh, waiting for this. <laughs> so it's going to give it her in a minute. So, no mistakes. I mean, this, the next thing that Amy's going to show you was a bargain. I mean, we felt bad only paying what we what did. We I mean, paid? we paid £15 for this. <coughs> and it's uh, from a person called uh, v Vivina Henry. Vivina Henry. Uh, she was the artist. Although we could, every time we go, we won't buy any more artwork because we've literally have a pile of things that we need to, that be, need framed. to be framed. So, uh, yeah, there's her card. Again, we'll put her details below. And she's a, such a lovely, lovely girl. And um, we talked to her for quite a while to the point where I think I'm going to ask her to commission me a tattoo. A tattoo yeah, I think. Um, this is the it. only one she's done. She hasn't done more than this one, so this is the original. Mm -hmm. she's and done. it's signed. Yes, she, it's um, signed. Me and Alice are currently having a debate as to whose room it's going in. Mine. <laughs> Look at that. Look at the detail. Yeah, back. So, you know, go forward just slowly, slowly. Mm -hmm. So it's Tiana, if you, if you guys didn't know. Uh, her Princess and the Frog. Yeah. Look at the detail in the water and on a dress. So it's a really nice painting, so, you know, and £15 for that, when we felt, I said to her, I was like, yeah. I, I thought she could easily charge up to 30 for that. These guys, Raptors World, um, absolutely brilliant. I, I seem to spend majority of the day 
there with Alice. What was the name of the dinosaur called again? Chomper. Chomper. They yeah. had a little triceratops. Triceratops. I think you look like, yeah. Um, and it, oh, it was so cute. Um, obviously, you've seen it in the video. You could have feed it, and then they let Alice sit on it, and it could it can walk. Um, I didn't know it could walk. Yeah, I'm sure that's what the boy said because you can sit on it because it has a. I don't oh, know. right. Okay. That's something. I, 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 it looked like it could walk. Oh, and obviously right, okay. its eyes moved, its head moved, it burped. Um, so yeah, she was really happy. She kept feeding it all day. Yeah, so that's that was how a lot of my day but, was spent. But they also had the uh, giant the raptor though. Well. You would have seen that in the video, and I'm sure you will have yeah, no, that, Alice's scared face. Yeah, she wasn't too keen on it. Very, she, but she weren't too keen on uh, Johnny Five either. But you know, I'm so tempted to book him for Alice's fifth birthday. Yeah, that would, you know, the scar <laughs> of her life. Yeah, oh, what a wonderful birthday, mummy. You made me crap my pants. Yeah, maybe. Right, okay. Okay, um, and I just bought one more thing. Um, these were from Possum Gifts. Possum Crafts. Crafts, oh. I think it Possum was. Crab, but, um, we didn't get a business card, did we? Oh, did we not? No. Oh, didn't. Possum Crafts, I thought it was. Yeah, no, no. I think you're right. Because yeah. you were like, oh, you can see that one. Um, and these are just some, oh, they're textured, I didn't even notice. Really nice, sparkly, mermaidy earrings. There you go. There was another. Uh, uh, ent well, entertainer, uh, professional cosplayer. Negan. Negan. So I think if you're quite a regular to. Hang on, you didn't show him enough. I did. He was really cool. So, so this is the guy. I mean, he was really good with Alice. Mm -hmm. We've he... seen him quite a few times at quite a few different. Yeah, he said he did Walker Stalker. Um, where else have we seen him? I think we've only seen him at Walker Stalker, but uh, I mean. No, was he not at CovCon? Yeah, he was at CovCon. CovCon and Walker Stalker. Yeah. Um, and he's a really convincing Negan. Yeah, he is. Um, he is. And it's weird how he just goes from his like Negan voice to... Uh, was it you think he was a... Like his... Um, his I don't know. I mean, his, his southern... His southern accent. Well, I thought he, he sounded a bit like a brummy at one point. Yeah, yeah. But he's, he's, he's such a nice guy. Really nice guy. So we spent a lot of time talking to him just, because just, Alice wanted to talk to him but then got shy and... Yeah, that so was... he convinced her to do, to hold the bat. Yeah, and he did a good job at that. So yeah. he, did, he did well with that. So, so thank, thank you. you for that. <laughs> um, anyway, we'll see you again. Well, no, by the time we post this, we'll see you on Wednesday. In Facebook Live two video. Two days. Three days. For Sunday. Two? No, but if you post this tomorrow. Oh yeah, two days. Yes. <laughs> okay, it will see you in two days. He wouldn't make it on TV, would he? Let's be honest. On live TV, I'm mm. alright live. Hopefully we can figure out the comments properly this time because yeah, it kept being delayed. Yeah, if anybody knows how to do that because we noticed we'd only get majority of the comments when we came off Facebook Live. So we'd only get one or two coming through as we were live, um, but then we got nothing. I think there was so a, I feel like I we think missed there, quite I think a there was a delay with Facebook. I think it was Facebook's issue because I've done that before and it was fine. So hopefully it'll come oh, through right. pretty much, pretty quick. Either way, we'll try and answer anything you yes. got to say to us and... Uh, mm -hmm. We'll uh, speak to you soon, so bye. bye.